The following video is rated PG-13, which may contain scenes and themes unsuitable for viewers under 13. My name is Microsoft Mike, and I'm hungry. Whopper 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 Junior Double Triple Whopper Flame, grilled taste with perfect copper I rule this day let- Shit post! Here's what to do when you don't find the rainbows in this time. Here's where you go when it looks like a rainbow in. Don't cry. There's always tomorrow where you can have a second chance. And after tomorrow, all that you have to remember is what you Again. Another round of logo blunders. And just one more day to go until the start of summer. Yup. The 2024 summer season is almost upon us. And we absolutely have no idea what the heck is going to happen this year. Expect some rain and thunderstorms ahead. Lily! Welcome to the TG1994 family, Vanaglama. How's things? Well, nothing much. We're gonna have a beautiful day today, I assume. What's with the weather forecast thing? Can we get on with this? But of course, Mike. Not trying to spoil the fun. Rules up. Anyway, roll camera. Cue the peacock. <laughs> the following program is brought to you in living color on. When I fail, I learn and grow. The more I try, the more I know. Now, what the hell just happened? I think we got Wombat rolled. Through this crap for a long time. What did you expect? A rickroll? <laughs> the fact. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Spoggy, spoggy, spoggy. Mike, Mike, Mike. Didn't I already warn you not to put up TV channel logos on national television? It's supposed to be NBC, not RTP2. Change it now or you're going to Brazil. See! The following program is brought to you in living color on... This Disney DVD is enhanced with Disney's Fast Play. Your movie and a selection of bonus features will begin automatically. Okay, we're resting Disney DVD on Fast Play. That's cool! It won't be cool, if Scotty keeps messing around with the logo. Temper temper, Mike. Whatever. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. CBC Kids. Up next, Paw Patrol. When will this shit ever end? Absolutely never! <laughs> nice fun. Different map. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. MTV. Back in my day when MTV was music television, they used to air music videos. But now they are reality shows such as Teen Mom, Jersey Shore, and more. Not to mention they now air those shitty ridiculousness marathons almost all day, and they are literally milking their channel with it. This is not the MTV I used to love. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Yeah. 
Real monsters. Scary hookers. Anus of Smurfs Missums. All Mouse Butterfinger. My Butterfinger. My Butterfinger. My Butterfinger. Blah 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 blah. Fall out girl. Fall out girl. Seuss. Seuss. That face though. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. RTL Club. Not to be confused with the Hungarian RTL Club, now known as just RTL. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Okay, now this is getting completely random. I'd buy that for a dollar. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Despicable Me 4. Oh man, I can't wait to see that film in July. It's going to be awesome. The following program is brought to you in living color on... Scotty! Mike! G4P Studios on NBC. What the hell is wrong with you? It's not G4P Studios, it's NBC. That logo was supposed to play out when this video was over. Breaking the force wall again? That's not so polite of you, like you. It's explosion time. Hold up a second. Did the fourth wall house just talk? This is uncanny. I thought he never spoke at all. He must have gained a voice or something. That must be a reference to Dave Madsen's universe. Then Alex's. Then Chloe's or perhaps Max and. God damn it, Maggie. Don't tell me you look see. No, I didn't, okay? Alright, fine. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. It's Subaru. Does anybody own a Subaru? Not me. I own a Fiat. And I own a good old Volkswagen myself. The following program is brought to you in livid color. Jeez Louise, the NBC peacock has become a zombie. Okay, wow. Now that is scary. Of course it's scary. I know this is just a theory, but still. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Cuba. NBC used to air the Cuba Saturday morning block until it was replaced by NBC Kids in 2012. I'm sure they used to air do- Don't you dare say that, Vanna. We all get it. Oh! Okay, okay! Jesus! The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. My adventures with Superman. Superman is my hero. But what about Batman? The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. The Nintendo Switch. What's next? The PS5? The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Now cut that out. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Watch this. R.I.P. and Boonshai. What the heck? And is Anne dead? Wait, wait, you mean me? Not you, Anne. The other Anne from the Yellowverse. 
We heard that Han was shot and killed in a drive-by shooting caused by Minecraft Elimination Zone contestant Rex of Sears Mafia. The ex- Good grief! Why would these gangsters do that? I'd rather not explain everything else, Mabel. This situation involving Rex Sasir is just too complicated. I mean, what else is going to show up? <laughs> The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. One week until season two. Wait, what do you mean season two? Wait, is this true? Eleanor wonders why season two is coming. Please tell me this is just a stupid joke. Unfortunately, it's not, Hank. Eleanor wonders why season two is happening, and it's very real. Oh my god, no. No, 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 that was during the time TEG-1994 became a soap opera cliché. Why? Lord! Why? Why are you doing this to us? This is horror. Boo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Calm down, Sam. You know Eleanor Rabbit is still dead. Or is she? Goodness me. Is that who I think it is? Oh my gosh, I cannot believe in my eyes. It's Ladybird Lou herself. That's impossible. I thought G4PTV and Ramon banned her. Fuck the ban! I bypassed it and now gained a cartoon villain citizenship again. What are you talking about? Ever since Raymond and Norman banned you, we have been trying to forget you. You can't just barge in here! If all the TEG 1994 and G4 PTV fans see this, they'll be very furious at you. So what exactly is Lou planning to do? Hack G4 PTV's channel again? I wasn't really planning to do that, but I am going to terrorize all of you all summer long. Great! So we're stuck with that stupid whiny Ladybird girl for a while? This is not gonna end well? I agree. I mean, just who brought Ladybird Lou back here anyway? Does this answer your question? Jeez Louise, it's my evil twin in Volcano Ash. So it was those two that brought Ladybird Lou back. Why would you do that? Lou was supposed to stay banned. Stop the ban. Lou was sick and tired of not having any freedom. So we rescinded Lou's ban and will terrorize all your lives all summer long. Hot 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 hot. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. What the actual fuck? So Lou is actually in league with those infernal imps now. This is just wrong. Why would Lou do this? I know who we can call. Don't you dare say it, you bitch. There is one good reason why we are here. And why would that be? Wally Warner, a BJ Adventure Vlog Sock Puppet, is furious after what happened with him and demands an end to the X drama. Hold it right there. BJ Adventure Vlog is associated with Rex Sasir and his mafia. He has been supporting them since. Yeah, so what? He only joined business with them just so they could bring down G4PTV together. That's nonsense! BJ would never do that! She's, She's right. right. Bringing Lady Verdue back, back into this into channel, channel is a mistake. Is a mistake. You, you must reban her immediately. I object! My ban removal is not a mistake. It's freedom. Well, listen to you, princess. You're being overdramatic. Wait a minute. Did my evil twin and Volcana somewhat access Bubblegum's Project 17 experiment to bring Lou back despite her ban? That's none of your business, you asswipe. Now keep Lou where she should be, or next time we'll ever bring even her back to... My will my strongly will forbid that. that. Take that. Take that. Take that. Curses. We've been beaten. My head hurts like crazy. We'll get you next time, cowards. 
Oh, my fractured sphincters. Don't worry, fellas. I managed to take care of that ladybird for you. Phew. Thanks, Brandon. Now we don't have to worry about that whiny baby for now. No problem. Just yell out when trouble strikes. Uh, Alpha logo. Go to it. <laughs> The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. Um, what the heck is this? Is that Lydia's sister? Or is it just an early prototype design of herself? I'm really sure that is the earliest version of Lydia, and I have never seen that before. Tonight, Olivia Worthington Mysteries Redux. Forget the early design mystery thing. Let's just take a break for now and go out for lunch. Oh, yeah, and don't forget to add some gyros with mayo and ketchup in it. Thank you. I can already feel my mouth watering. Jesus Christ. Chuck Billy Plays, celebrating its first anniversary, dedicates the life of Aunt Blue Chai, who died after a drive-by shooting a couple of days ago. That's next on G4 PTV Gaming, followed by a new Micro Gamers video where the team plays epic minigames on Roblox.